Good morning guys and happy Wednesday. Our latest will be about Julius Mademan Jandalax and aka let's follow up on that. There are posts making rounds on social media alleging that the Julius Malema is the next to follow following the passing of aka. This is what they said. This was on Facebook and they said dear Julius Malema, they are now planning on assassinating you while you are in your car, beef up your security. This is another one and it reads as follows, this year 2023 there's going to be an assassination or sudden death of a leading politician in SA. His death will drive the country to total destruction, right close to the cliff of collapse similar to what almost transpired after the assassination of Chris Honey in 1993. The tweet was even before AKA was assassinated. Now this is raising concerns as Njandalax has been warning Julius Malema to not go ahead with the national shutdown. On social media people said what if our uh, enemies will capitalize on national shutdown day and do something to Julius Malema with the intention to pin everything to Njandalax. But other social media users said there is nothing planned against Julius Malema because according to them Julius Malema is not that important. And here are some of the comments this user LK said if Chris Honey was assassinated and we did nothing about it who is Julius Malema? Ndombenja said but Malema is not patriot my life will continue as usual nothing will change. And uh, Prince said you'll be blaming Floyd for stretching his hands and by that time Zulu boys will be done with him. Moko said he's not everyone's god he is your idol we also have our own idols. And Lucas said propaganda be careful of the power of tongue. And that's all we have for now. Please remember to leave your comments down below and let us know of your take regarding what you've covered. That will be all from me. Thank you so, so much for tuning in. I'll see you again in the next update. Bye.